Exercise number three. This is the Flex Lewis Smith Machine Tricep Extension. Do you like that? We'll call it something. I tell you what, we'll leave, we'll leave it up to these guys. Okay, okay. All, I do, know it, I, all I do know is it hurts. Man. Okay, good. So, you can throw whatever you want to call it, but basically, it hurts. Yeah. That's so, the, <laughs> this is the most it, important thing, right? That's the most important thing, it works. Okay, so, and so. this is a high rep, this is a high volume one to finish, so and we're training the triceps with a lot of volume, a lot, yeah. of, lot of volume, or yeah. blood volume. Well, today, like we spoke about off camera, um, this, there's many different ways, obviously, to uh, to train anybody. Um, and going into certain shows, you know, obviously injury pending, um, different training styles um, will suit you. You know, you gotta find out what works for you, and this is something that's worked for me. I like training my triceps heavy, but I also like training them with high volume. And since we're yep. keeping that high volume theme today, and we have thrown in a couple of her heavy sort of presses. Yep. We'll, keep, we'll, we'll continue that theme and we'll do um, another high volume exercise. Right. If it hasn't been enough, we're going to keep on going. So if, if your arms are not already falling off, you know, falling out, falling out of your sleeves, um, we're going to make sure it's done and dusted on this set. Done. So done. Let's then, do let, it. Let's do this. Show us how it's done. So again, uh, using the, the Smith machine, conventional Smith machine bar here, grip is pretty much um, you know, shoulder width, I would say. Mm. You can actually move it slightly in, but not too far. What we're going to do is, my middle fingers here, you know, you, this is a standard bar. So the grooves, you've got the, the, the standard press here, groove, and then you obviously got the inner. My middle fingers are normally within there. So again, shoulder width. Yep. So, Beautiful. throw my legs out. Um, it looks like I'm doing like a swan dive, I would say. And throw in, I throw in my body. Very forward. graceful. Hey, listen, <laughs> that's my middle name. <laughs> throw my body, throw my body forward, and elbows, you know, in, conventionally in. So, um, I'm actually doing a stretch forward. My head, you know, is the right there. Yeah, as you can see, it's behind. Um, I would say, well, where, where would you say that? Just about an inch above the neck, Nick. Yep, about an inch above the neck. You and got again, it. Again, I'm pressing forward. Pressing forward in the in the press and then come, uh, and coming up and extending my arms. So I'll do a couple of reps to show you. You can see the stretch too, big stretch movement again, folks. Stretch into mm. an extension to a press. This is a great exercise, folks. I can't wait to try this myself. This sort of variety from a champion like Flex is a secret that we're really, really privileged to get, guys. You know, and you're crazy if you don't put this in. To your training arsenal, final exercise for the triceps. No, this is something I, I pretty much could only do one rep of when I first started. Truth. Right. And and then it's built up over time now. I probably could do about 50. Okay. So I just say we've just done 30 reps, 20 or whatever, whatever you can do. We're moving our body up okay. over the bar. And I'm coming in again straight down. Legs are uh, out. I would probably say. Um, a foot, uh, probably a foot and a half, two foot out, and I'm coming in to the power on my chest, but I'm not locking out. Okay. So everything is in in that groove. Yep. Stretching at the bottom. So it's like you're doing a um, close grip bench. Close press grip bench press. Yep. Beautiful. By using your body weight. Yep. But you're not locking out. So it's in the in the in the bucket, as they say, without locking out. Yeah, without locking out. Same as the previous exercise. So. If you want to rest, come up, stretch, and this is to the death. There's no numbers in the second. Okay, okay. Go in again. Keep going. Constant tension. Look at it, guys. Constant tension. Working through that mid range, like Flex says, in the pocket. Tension on the triceps the whole time. Now, if you really want to be sadistic and you want to throw a third in, take your hat back. So that's where you mean business, right? The hat goes This back. is the finisher and you're basically doing a stretch again, throwing your elbows in, yep. and you're doing it to the forehead. Oh, okay, right, right. And you're not locking out again. And this is to the death. Look at all the angles here, guys. Flex has got all the angles going on here, and this has got to be one of the secrets to this incredible tricep development. And this is what you're going to be doing right now. <laughs> so if there's no pressure, <laughs> there is no. Okay. So this is a working set to the death. All right, so middle fingers on the groove where the knurling finishes. Yeah. My body weight's about, my body position's about right. That's about right. Now throw them in and stretch forward. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Okay, one. Two, as you can see, guys, he's coming in and he's throwing his, his whole body forward. And then he's thrown up to full extension. There we go. 
that's it. It's a pendular motion, you know, your body's going down and it's coming back up. This is a working set, so you guys are going to see it from the champ himself. Yeah, live and direct, working set. Here we go, now he's working, now he's working, we've got another two of these. Throw him up now, come on. Yeah. One more, one more to the death, let's go. Up, up, good, yep. okay, bring it in. Straight in. Bottom of the chest, bring it, there we go. I said no lockout. No lockout on this. Right here. One. Stop. Two. Stop there. There we go. Stop. Come up a little bit so it's hitting. Come up with your legs. There. That's it. Right there. Perfect. Perfect. No lockout. There. Stop. There. Good. Good. That's it. Keep working. All tension is on there. All tension. A little higher. There. Stop. There. Stop. So you're basically stopping like like at a fist, right there, and then you. Oh yeah, it's that's like hard it, of it. It's, it's consistent tension, consistent tension. There's no number. Just keep going. You can see, guys. Nick's so lean. You can see everything working. That's all tricep, all tricep. Keep working. Come on to the death. All the pressure for me. I put all of my palms, guys. So there's no uh, unnecessary stress yeah. anywhere else. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Five, uh, four, uh, three, yeah. two, yeah. one. All right, let's get yeah. really sadistic and throw him to the head. Let's go. Throw him through. Here. Throw him through. Here. There we go. Aye. Elbows in, elbows in, elbows in. Aye. Stop before the bar. Stop before the bar. There we go. Aye. Good. Come on. Come Up. on. Let's do this. There we go. Come on. Keep Up. working. Keep working. Up. Keep working. Keep working. Up. There we go. Let's go five. Fifth uh, place. Yeah. Fourth. Shay. Third. Up. There. Second. Aye. Last one for first. Yeah. Last one for first. Drive. Good. Aye. Woo. There we go, guys. Live and direct. <laughs> <laughs> How do you think about that? Oh, that's amazing, huh? And I'm thinking if I've done three big giant sets to start with, three to four sets on the press. Yep. With the partials then finishing with this. Yeah. I mean I've only done one set here, this is my second set. Mm -hmm. And I feel like I've done a full tricep workout, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. and it, it's something again that I've, I've been doing for a number of years now. And again, bear in mind that this is coming from somebody who had a not good arm development. So, you know, they say seek seek somebody who, who has built something good from nothing. It's like asking, um, I, I've asked people who, with with great chess who genetically had no chess to actually improve my chest because that is my weakest body part and, and some of the advice that they've given me has actually helped me significantly. So again, looking at photos of old guys, you can find on the net that as a junior, yes. my arm development wasn't the best. So I had a fine way in bringing it up. And, and again, what we've just done now is one of the things that has helped me you know, develop my arm. Um, you know, in the last uh, in the last couple of years. Yeah, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised at all. How many sets would we do here to finish? Is it just the one? Is that what I've done? That's it? No, we put about two or three. Two or three. <laughs> it all depends. If if, if I feel depends like how sadistic you want to be, exactly, right? Exactly. Okay. Okay. Exactly. My okay. my training partners of old. Um, I say of old because they're no longer around. Um, <laughs> surprise, surprise. They, 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 we used to, you know, basically go into the last man standing. So we uh, we'd feed off each other's energy. You know, he sure. would do a set, I would do a set. We'd look at each other and do another one. Let's yep. do another one. I was like, "There's more in the tank. Let's do another one." So, um, you know, we're, we're not we're not ego driven. You know, none of my training partners were, but we're having we're having fun, and it, and it's all, you know, it's all within range. Yeah, and, and, and it's, it's supporting each other, right? It's not particularly about beating the other guy. It's, no, it's, it's about supporting each other and receiving the support back. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. You know, it's like if your training partner knows you you have an extra rep. He should be shouting at you, saying like, "Listen, you had another rep." But there's a there's a fine line between doing a fourth fourth rep that was no no need of. It's yep. like I knew you had another five. Yeah, with and good you, form, with good you, form, and right? And you push them out. Yep. And like I was saying, a little bit of psychological push as well. Top five. Yep. You know that gets in there somewhere. And again, I've, I'm very blessed to have great people around me and my training partners of, of old and 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 recent and, and now. Um, you've all been there for the physical and the psychological. So, you know, it's a uh, bodybuilding is such a a diverse, um, you know, 
Well, it's like psychology can pull us apart, really, because we're, we're such a, a diverse bunch of guys that, again, all have one love, and that's throwing weights around. But again, I can see that you know Nick is is uh, you know uh, one of the OGs here in the sport. And, you know, he's <laughs> he's been there, done that, and, and got the T-shirt. And and the great thing about what he does and what I do. All the way to the new guy, we're always learning. This is exactly, a sport exactly. that I could pick his brain up, pick his brain, and, and he could give me advice on something, and I'd be like, wow, I want to do this. And then, you know, something I might have picked up recently, he could he, he feed off me too. So again, yeah. jet lag is kicking in, but <laughs> I'm trying to dig deep for you guys. And now he just done his set, I think I want to do one too, but we're going to do mine off camera because he might have done more reps than me. <laughs> Flex Lewis, ladies and gentlemen, look, we've been so blessed to have Flex share his true training secrets. You won't see that kind of tricep workout anywhere. We always get the four exercises, the four sets, pyramiding the weight down. We never get these big combinations like this. And like Flex said, he actually used to have weak triceps. So this is not something he do, does to maintain his tricep development. This is what he did to build these fantastic triceps. So we've been blessed, folks. We've been treated. Support this guy, Flex. Thank you so much. Thank you, my friend. It's a pleasure. And 12 months ago, I said to this guy, keep trying. Go and win that Mr. Olympia title. <laughs> He's gone and done it. He's reached the pinnacle of our sport. And it's because of his attitude he gives to the fans. He's supporting us here today. This, is, this guy is down to earth. He's at the pinnacle of the sport. But Flex is a true people's champion, guys. So support him. Get behind him. And uh, thanks again, mate. We wish Thank you all you the best guys. for the future. And to Arjun Thak, guys, this is a, a trip that I'm, you know, I would be here every year on. Australia has treated me very well, all the way from my rugby days. Yep. All the way to my bodybuilding. And I've been here now, um, I think this is my seventh year oh, wow. in Australia. So my fan base keeps on getting bigger and better. And this weekend was, again, a testament to, to that. You know, I had a line that was wrapped around the BSN booth and I'm very blessed to to uh, keep keep on coming here and, and keep on giving, you know, getting on that plane, that 26 hour flight, but knowing when I get here, I'm so well received that I'll keep on coming here every, each and every year. So again, Nick, thank you very much. And for you guys watching this, thank you so much. I will see you wherever it'll be, whether it's in Australia, at the Olympia, at the Arnold, but make sure that uh, you get a handshake and uh, if you can understand this accent, I'll talk all day. <laughs> Half of us are English here, mate, so we get you, don't worry. Thanks, guys.